The main components of a Framo hydraulic system are a hydraulic oil tank, a hydraulic pump, a hydraulic control valve assembly, a hydraulic motor, and a cargo pump. A feed pump supplies oil from the storage tank to the hydraulic pump at a pressure of about six bars. The hydraulic pump pressurizes this oil to a pressure of 200 to 250 bars. This high pressure oil is delivered to the speed torque controller, which turns a hydraulic motor coupled to a centrifugal cargo pump. The pump turns only when the control valve assembly releases control oil to that particular motor. If the cargo pump fails to turn, what checks will you instruct the ship staff to carry out to locate the problem? You should have a diagram of this system in front of you while troubleshooting. Click on the highlighted area in the graphic and follow the right sequence. This is not a first check you should do, though it is not incorrect. Try another one. Change over control from cargo control room and try out. If the problem is solved, then the problem could be an electrical or electronic problem with hydraulic control valve assembly. If the problem persists, what next? Click on the highlighted area. Yes, this orifice could be choked. Cleaning this could solve the problem. If the problem persists, what next? Click on the highlighted area. Yes, the speed torque controller could be defective. Repairing or replacing could solve the problem. If the problem persists, what next? Go to the valve assembly and click on the highlighted area. Yes, this orifice could be choked. Cleaning this could solve the problem. If the problem persists, what next? Click on the highlighted area. The solenoid valve could be defective. Repairing or replacing this valve could solve the problem. In another occasion, the system hydraulic pressure was found fluctuating between 75 to 225 bars during startup. The system was vented from all vented points and all relief valves were checked. The problem could not be solved on board. Tell contractors to ask ship staff to remove and clean the proportional control valve. Problem solved. It was understood that there was presence of minute rust particles that are not visible to the naked eye. This was a unique case not experienced by ship staff earlier. The important thing is, it is a logical approach, which helps you in troubleshooting as some knowledge of the basic principles of control system and automation helps you greatly in troubleshooting and solving problems in these systems. Finally, as a technical manager, you should make use of all available resources in case a problem gets out of control.